in its proper position, the toe grip does not touch the nail bed, which is where the nail meets the hairline. And also the toe grip is completely on the toenail and the tip of the nail is protruding. If the tip of the nail is not protruding, there's a high likelihood that the toe grip will not stay on. And this is something that you'd want to just check daily, just do a quick visual inspection while your dog is wearing toe grips to make sure that they're in the proper position. Dr. Busby's toe grips have allowed us to kind of give Gus a new life. As um, we found like as he's worn him, not only is he more stable in the house, but now when he's outside, he runs around. He's lifting his leg to potty again. He's trying to jump up on the furniture like he's not supposed to. They're wonderful. After we applied toe grips for the first time, and I saw um, a tremendous improvement, no more flish, flipping that back leg out. Um, she was walking real steady on the tile. Um, I actually could pull up the rugs that I put down, which was wonderful. So, um, so she was really a lot more confident on the tile, and the walk was great. So it really made such a big difference. So. I can tell you, she, she uh, immediately within one week, I could notice a huge difference. And then over the past month, it just continued on improvement from there.